Tron founder Justin Sun releases first Cortronics volunteer list. On July 5th, Sun, who's the founder of Tron, made the announcement that the very first batch of the Cortronics has just been selected. They are the hardworking volunteers who have been behind the scenes helping the Tron Foundation and keeping the pace that has helped in the gradual growth. Earlier today, the founder tweeted that the very first batch of the Cortronics list is finally out. Together with this tweet that was released, Justin Sun went ahead and attached the Medium article, which was able to break down the words. This helped in explaining more on what the Tronics is really about, just to ensure a clear picture has been painted for all. The community of Tron also just held its very first super representative election, which was mainly based by votes casted by the community. The community was able to elect about 27 representatives, but this is not all, as the SR candidates ensured they went on to have this live on video, where they were able to offer a brief explanation on why, how, and what they have really planned for Tron. New developments taking place. On the 21st of June, Tron went ahead and set up the token relocation development because the TRX withdrawals was suspended till the 25th of June. Prior to the migration, the TRX users held the ERC20 tokens that were already successful producers on the Ethereum network. But with the aggregated TRX on the ERC token, will not be required anymore as Tron platform has moved from the ERC-20 to a new Tron-20, which is being considered as the native coin for the Tron mainnet. Go ahead and click the link right below the video for the full scoop on this story. And what's your thoughts behind Tron and Justin's son? Are you a believer in the project? I'm looking forward to reading your comments down below. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button. As always, thanks for tuning in. Catch you on the next video.